19-point third quarter lead. The officiating group, Mark Davis, Kenny Fitzgerald, and Tyler Ford. So the Rockets control the ball in the hands of Harden. Goes off the pick from Howard. This is Pat Beverly. And get the rebounds to Portland. They have to do better. Houston securing the defensive possession by getting the rebound. And that block on the six foot ten Bontley. He's been hesitant, but really where he's at his best is getting into the paint and making plays for himself and his teammates as he, as he did right there, finding the 30, 114. Incidentally, Curry also seven rebounds, eight assists. <laughs> wow. Just keeps raising the bar at the point guard position, Curry. As a meter down. Lillard right back for the three point. Without fouling, but I tell you, Harkless, his size, length, energy, and athleticism, and his play as of late has been tremendous for the Trailblazers. Harkless goes 6'9", about 225. Gerald Henderson has come on for the first time for Portland. Smooth follow. And here's Harden moving across. Harden played by Henderson. Fires for three. Lillard, played by Ariza, goes to the beautiful spin and scores! Davis rebounds, here's Crabb, has a two-on-one for Harkless! Young legs and their ability to change ends. A nice little spurt here to finish the first quarter. Final seconds of the first. Lawson with the step back, yes. 2.6 remaining in the first. Five-point lead for Portland. Collum, played by Brewer. Still an excellent defender. This is Crabb, guarded by Jason Terry, who hit that jumper just a moment ago. They swing it around. Here's Anderson for three. And he can do it today. Off the turnover. This is hard taking all the letter. And a feet ahead. Crab. Nice ball move. Davis with the finish. For the Rockets. Terry Stott staying with the combination of Apollo and Henderson. Beautiful move off. The but getting this young team to really buy into playing defense is really a large part why they've been so successful here in these last 18 to 20 games. And he said they got a break back in, in January. Like Sidney Wicks and Jeff Petrie in 1973. Wow, you'd think with all the great guard combinations we've had in the league, that would have happened before that. Going way back to George Gervin and James Simon. Oh, beautiful. Oh, by as many as 18. The in the second quarter on a 21-9 run the first six minutes. Blazers in possession as this second half gets underway. It's a three-pointer and a 67-49 advantage for the Blazers. Ariza on the hop. Howard with the Lillard for Plumley. Again, the ball movement. McCollum plays it on the deflection. Hits from but those two, as we talked earlier about their chemistry, is Harden and it's really a, a sign of respect. I don't think there's a realistic chance. Oh, nice move. There is this, this deal. I like that. Explaining it to myself. After <laughs> I point out that, yes, it is Thursday in most parts of the country. Still in time to yeah. do some shopping after the game. Kept alive here by the Rockets. Harden for three. Uh, deals here is one of the best two guards in the league. Harden has played most of the game. Sack for just like three minutes. Harden for the team. And things have turned. Rockets use the clock. 15 seconds remaining in the quarter. 15 seconds in for Angelo Hart for three again. He now has 27 points. Final seconds of the third. Harkless, but it moves on. Harkless, it's cut quarters. I'll tell you, James Harden, 28 a game, 7 assists. You know you can't neutralize him as he draws a foul. on The Mavericks from Dallas. 
There's Lillard getting inside. He did in the first half against Ariza. He attacked him, got to the basket on that particular play. Rockets by six. Grab the seven on Hart, who shoots over. And now has to defend on these possessions here in the last two minutes. So after the free throw, Rockets with the possession. Hart to the rim. Right back, led by James Harden in the second half. I, I am stunned too. This is why it was a big game. As Lillard knocks down a